Bombers, large, lumbering aircraft assigned to deliver horrific payloads far into enemy territory, dominated the skies during World War II. Among this fleet of giants, one aircraft stood out, a bomber that seemed more like a future concept than a 1940s product. The Douglas XB-42 Mixmaster is a radical machine that flies almost as fast as it appears. A new concept in bombing. Bombers were the backbone of aerial warcraft during the height of World War II. Nonetheless, these vehicles were sometimes slow, well-equipped, and vulnerable to enemy fighter attack. The Douglas Aircraft Company envisioned a bomber that defied conventions by being faster, lighter, and more efficient. The XB-42 Mixmaster emerged from a unique idea that combined speed and payload capacity in a tiny and attractive form. Unlike the B-17s and B-24s of the time, which relied on substantial defensive weapons to survive missions, the XB-42 attempted to completely avoid risks. Its sleek fuselage and forward-looking propulsion system promised to alter bomber operations by prioritizing speed and efficiency over brute strength. The XB-42's innovative design involved twin engines arranged inside the fuselage to drive rear-mounted contra-rotating propellers. One of the fastest piston engine bombers ever designed, this pusher system reduced drag and allowed for a more aerodynamic profile. The XB-42's tiny size allowed it to carry a much larger payload than previous bombers, and its clean, unobstructed wings contributed to even lower drag. The XB-42 was a true outlier in aircraft design, as its combination of speed, efficiency, and capacity was unprecedented. Designed primarily as a bomber for the 1940s modern battlefield, the Mixmaster could deliver its cargo quickly and effectively while outpacing enemy defenses. This aircraft promised to change the rules for aerial combat. Revolutionary Design the XB-42 Mixmaster was not only revolutionary, but also a stark departure from what most people considered a bomber to be. Traditional bombers, heavily armed, were designed to slog across the skies. The Mixmaster, with its distinctive design, turned that philosophy on its head, prioritizing speed and efficiency. The XB-42's propulsion system was one of its most unique features. Instead of traditional wing-mounted engines, the Mixmaster had two Allison V-1710 engines housed within the fuselage. These engines, mounted in back, powered a pair of contra-rotating propellers that eliminated drag caused by exterior engine nacellus, resulting in a smoother, more aerodynamic profile. Contra-rotating propellers enhanced performance, rather than simply providing a creative design choice. These propellers lessen each other's torque by revolving in opposite directions, which improves stability and thrust efficiency. This technology enabled the XB-42 to achieve speeds much exceeding those of conventional bombers at the time. Another striking feature of the Mixmaster was its clean wing design. The XB-42 had clutter-free wings by moving the engines inside and eliminating the need for heavy defensive gun turrets, resulting in significantly lower drag and improved aerodynamic performance. Every component of the airplane was also motivated by speed and efficiency. The XB-42's streamlined fuselage, cutting-edge materials, and imaginative layout made it both a work of art and a technological marvel. Performance and Flight Tests when the XB-42 Mixmaster first flew in May 1944, it lived up to its performance promise. Known as one of the quickest piston engine bombers ever built, the Mixmaster flew with the speed and grace of a fighter jet, as opposed to the lumbering bombers of the day. The Mixmaster was quicker than many modern fighters of the time, reaching speeds of up to 410 miles per hour. It had a range of almost 2,000 miles and could fly at altitudes of up to 29,400 feet, ensuring that it could deliver its pay payload deep into enemy territory while avoiding most dangers. The cockpit design reflected the aircraft's groundbreaking character. The pilot and co-pilot sat side by side in a modern, streamlined cabin with controls designed specifically for their layout. Pilots praised the Mixmaster for its exceptional stability and smooth handling, especially at high speeds. The XB-42 demonstrated adaptability during flying tests. Its agility allowed it to do precise bombing runs, tight turns, and steep climbs, which were impossible for a bomber of its weight. 
The Mixmaster's agility and speed allowed it to operate without the need for heavy defensive weaponry or fighter escorts. Its advantage over enemy interceptors stemmed from the Mixmaster's speed and agility. Rather than relying on gunners to repel attacks, the XB-42 could simply outrun most threats, delivering its payload, and returning to base before the enemy had time to react. Challenges and Competition Although the XB-42 Mixmaster excelled in many ways, its original design created several technical challenges. Though it was a marvel of engineering, the unusual propulsion system, twin Allison V-1710 engines driving rear-mounted contra-rotating propellers, was a maintenance nightmare. The gearbox arrangement connecting the engines to the counter-rotating propellers required constant accuracy adjustments. The aircraft is less suited for frontline operations because any misalignment or mechanical failure could jeopardize the entire propulsion system. Maintaining the XB-42 necessitated a level of knowledge and tools that would have been difficult to scale for large military production. This complexity contributed to the Mixmaster's already extensive list of obstacles in transitioning from prototype to operation bomber. The sudden appearance of jet-powered bombers exacerbated these challenges. By the middle of the 1940s, aircraft such as the Boeing B-47 Stratajet were demonstrating the promise of jet power, offering even more speed, range, and payload capabilities than the piston engine designs. Despite its ingenuity, the Mixmaster realized it was in a race it couldn't win. The jet age had arrived, and military priorities shifted to aircraft capable of fully embracing the speed and efficiency of jet propulsion. Despite its original design, the XB-42 quickly became obsolete in the face of these advances. The XB-42 was ultimately a victim of its time. Although it held enormous promise, the next generation of bombers outperformed it due to technical issues and the rapid pace of aviation invention. The Legacy of the Mixmaster Although aircraft never saw actual service, the XB-42 Mixmaster exemplifies the inventive enthusiasm of wartime aviation. The Mixmaster's extraordinary engineering solutions and design push the boundaries of piston engine bombers. The Mixmaster was not just an experiment, but also a stepping stone. The concepts derived from its innovative propulsion system and aerodynamic efficiency had a direct impact on the development of bombers after World War II. Although piston engine bombers like the XB-42 were eventually rendered worthless by the jet age, its impact stretched far beyond its limited career. Aircraft like the B-47 Stratajet benefited from the foundation laid by the XB-42 by using simpler designs and more effective layouts. Many of the innovations tested on the Mixmaster, such as the use of enclosed engines to reduce drag, found new life in succeeding designs. The XB-42 also served as an example of how experimental aircraft could impact future trajectories. It demonstrated the need to take risks and study novel ideas, even if they do not directly lead to production procedures. Often, the insights gained pave the way for future breakthroughs. Today, the Mixmaster represents desire and inventiveness. The XB-42 Mixmaster may not have changed the course of history, but it remains a shining example of what's possible when innovation takes flight. What could have been? The XB-42 Mixmaster had unquestionably high potential. Its unique design, had it been created earlier in World War II or before jet-powered aircraft arrived, could have altered the role of bombers in modern battle. Its speed and efficiency could have provided the United States with a versatile platform suitable for long-range operations with minimal fighter support. Consider fleets of Mixmasters that rely on speed and agility rather than robust defensive weapons to race through opposing defenses. The XB-42 may have been a game-changer with its reduced crew and simplified maintenance requirements, reducing the Air Force's logistical load while delivering lethal accuracy attacks. The XB-42's modest size and effective propulsion system also make it suitable for multi-role operations. With modifications, it could have been suitable for electronic warfare fair, reconnaissance, or perhaps critical goods transit. History, however, had other designs. The Mixmaster's tenure was limited because jet technology advanced swiftly, and the Air Force's objectives shifted. Nonetheless, its legacy reminds us of the unrealized potential of aircraft that defy conventional design restrictions. The XB-42 Mixmaster gave a glimpse of another future of aerial combat, not merely a missed opportunity. 
Although it never served as a backbone of a bomber fleet, its daring design nevertheless evokes fantasies about what could have been. The Mixmaster in Popular Culture Even though it never saw battle, the XB-42 Mixmaster's distinctive design ensured its survival. A place in the hearts of aviation enthusiasts and a constant presence in popular culture. Documentaries, computer games, and even speculative fiction frequently feature it due to its futuristic appearance and technical genius. The Mixmaster continues to fly through the virtual heavens. Flight simulators recreate the XB-42, allowing enthusiasts to experience its speed, agility, and revolutionary features firsthand. Among gamers eager to fly one of history's most inventive bombers, its unique characteristics make it a favorite. This topic appeals to filmmakers and painters in particular due to its remarkable appearance. Its attractive, distinctive profile piques the interests of both observers and creators, reflecting the tremendous creativity of World War II aircraft. Beyond films and games, the XB-42 is now a popular topic in aviation communities around the world. Fans continue to examine its history, build scale models, and speculate on what might have happened if this incredible airplane had gone into production. From fan recreations to museum exhibits, the Mixmaster remains an icon of daring inventiveness. Its narrative speaks not only as a historical artifact, but also as a stimulus for future generations of engineers and dreamers. In popular culture, the XB-42 has established itself as an emblem of aviation history even after its limited career. Its story reminds us of the importance of creativity and the enduring appeal of ambitious ideas. Lessons Learned from the Mixmaster Although the XB-42 Mixmaster did not go into production, its narrative contains principles that are still important in aviation design. This was a daring attempt to push the boundaries of what a bomber could accomplish, and its inventive elements laid the groundwork for future discoveries. Today's stealth aircraft find fresh relevance in the forward-thinking idea of cutting drag by inserting the engines within the fuselage. Modern bombers, such as the B-2 Spirit, employ similar strategies to lower radar cross-sections and improve aerodynamic performance. The Mixmaster also emphasized the importance of balancing creativity with pragmatism. Its smart but sophisticated pusher-propeller design and contra-rotating propellers demonstrated the importance of systems that are not only creative, but also durable and maintainable in combat settings. The XB-42 provided an insightful investigation of the trade-offs between speed, efficiency, and operational complexity by pushing the boundaries of standard bomber design. These ideas have influenced the design of aircraft that combine modern technologies with practical applications. The XB-42 was in many ways ahead of its time. Its emphasis on minimal drag, speed, and efficiency anticipated the needs of future aircraft. Although the Mixmaster was designed for piston engines, it had a significant impact on jet and stealth technology. The XB-42's legacy is defined by lessons learnt beyond its design. It serves as a reminder that even airplanes not yet in production have a significant impact on the future of aviation. The XB-42 Mixmaster was a bold, forward look at aviation, not just a bomber. In the history of experimental aircraft, it was a one-of-a-kind combination of speed, elegant design, and innovative propulsion technology. Though it never served an active duty, the lessons it taught and the ideas it inspired live on. The Mixmaster reminds us that while invention entails some risks, those risks pave the way for progress. It's a tribute to daring engineering, pushing the boundaries of piston engine bombers and influencing subsequent aircraft design. We appreciate you joining us on our journey through the XB-42 Mixmaster tale. If you like learning about the legacy of this incredible aircraft, please like, comment, and subscribe for more aviation history. Tell us what you think. Was the Mixmaster ahead of its time, or was it simply an ambitious experiment? Keep looking up. Until next time.